Hi, my name is Adrian Austria with Texas Instruments, and today I'll be showing you how to use the Anarin Air A2541 Bluetooth Booster Pack with the MSP430 F5529 Launchpad. Before we get started, you're going to need the Anarin Air A2541 Bluetooth Booster Pack, the MSP430 F5529 Launchpad, a USB cable, and a Bluetooth enabled mobile device. In order to use software for this booster pack, you're going to need an mHub account. So you can register for an mHub account through the link below. Note that you'll need your 16 digit unique registration code on the side of your booster pack. Once you're done, registering for an account, go ahead and download the mBuilder IDE. Also, you're going to want to download the mBlinker application on your cell phone. All right, so let's get the hardware set up. On the MSP430 F5529, leave all jumpers in its default positions. If using an MSP430 G2 launchpad, Remove jumpers from RxD and TXD pins. For your booster pack, jumpers should be on JP1 as well as JP2. Jumpers should also be on pins 2 and 3 of JP3 and JP4. Connect both boards to make sure that both USB terminals are facing the same direction. Plug in your USB to your launch pad and to your computer. All right, let's begin programming with your mBuilder IDE. Go ahead and hit start, mBuilder IDE. Now the IDE will bring up a suggested workspace folder. Select the new file path if necessary. All right, take some time to read the cheat sheet on the right hand side to familiarize yourself with the IDE. In this video, we'll jump straight to the Blinker example. So open up the Blinker folder on the top left-hand corner of the Project Explorer. Right-click on Blinker EMS, .ems and select Build Schema. Right-click on the folder and select Clean Project. Then right click on the folder again and select build project. All right, let's go ahead and load this onto our 430 by clicking this button up here. All right, looks like our program's loaded in correctly. On your cell phone, turn on Bluetooth and start up the mBlinker app. On the top right corner, select a Bluetooth device you'd like to connect to. In this case, it would be the EDB device. Now once connected, you'll notice that the blue LED on the booster pack should be solid. This indicates a connection between your mobile device and the board. The mock LED on the app should be synchronized with LED2 of your launchpad. Go ahead and mess with the delay or on and off settings to explore the app's capabilities. In just a few minutes, you got your Anurin Air Bluetooth Booster Pack and your MSP430 F5529 launchpad working seamlessly together. Enjoy.